Hey everybody, Constable Burrito Cage back with more Let's Play Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage and I have to sneeze. <coughs> okay, great entrance. So, Breeze Harbor, home of birds. <laughs> you. What are you doing in there? Yeah, so a little bucket guys and enemies that attack with water. So, big area to be able to die here. Right at the beginning. Please excuse our mess, Beaky. We are currently suffering from a land oh my god. infestation. First they put out the fires on our boilers, and now they've shut down our ship, too. Not the ship. If you could stoke up the fires under the boilers, I'm sure you could make your way to the ship. The steam from the boilers will activate our highly advanced machines. Our highly advanced machines. That still run on the steam engine. Yeah, so uh, you flame these. And that will attract any of the water guys to come over and put the fire out. But before you go to the whirlwind, there's stuff behind it, so make sure you get that. And this don't look highly advanced. I mean, that's a pretty big machine. But really, I am extreme disappointed with their name of that guy. Beaky. He's a bird, and his name is Beaky. Um, those guys over there... Oh, this will introduce a new physic into the game, which is cannons. Which, you can't kill that guy right there without the cannon. But the, these guys are part of a task in the level. Which is sort of annoying to aim these guns. Because you don't really know exactly where they're gonna hit. There's no sense of targeting thing. And let's break that chest up there. Yo, I feel like there's something I have to shoot over here, but there's not. Okay, so let's get these gems around here, over here, and it took me forever to figure out you can just fly over to this one. Not too difficult. And so let's get more monies and get zapped and kill the firemen, who have extremely bad oral hygiene oral hygiene, because if you look at their teeth, they're just like, you. I mean, they got that one tooth that they can that you can see, and it is just green with rot. So, how you get over here is you just come up from the water, and you come over here. Yeah, but, and they're drinking out of their hoses, that sort of seems gross, but yeah, if you light these, before you kill the stuff, then they will just put it out. Oh, this part's fun. You got those little boats here. I mean, I can see how this machine is advanced. But, uh, well, we're gonna do that in a second. But first, we're gonna come over here and talk to Those land blubbers gobble. littered these metal spike mines all over the world. <sighs> if you can clear them out, Shoot down the floating mines. Difficulty 4. And somehow the mines are not affected by lava. Because they show up in the lava here. So just pick a spot where they're gonna. They're all gonna fly past. Sort of a difficult thing to find the spot. But once you find it, then you can hit all the ones that will come over. Here. That might be it. Alright, let's try and hit that thing over there. No, we missed. Put it down. Come on. There we go. Right on target, and there's nothing else over there. So, yeah, you got one more area that has those mines there. Let's get on the boat before it leaves. I'm on a boat. And you gotta jump off the boat at the correct time to get over here. And kill this guy in the bucket. And get that. And 
get the gems. And over here is the last of the floating mines. Spot. There's the spot. That's it, but there's some over here as well. Boom. Thanks, Spyro. Here's that orb I promised. I like how he just know he has clam juice on it. That's gross. But I like how he just sort of knows that all the things are done. He's like he gets like a psychic message in his mind. He's like I will know when the things are done, don't worry. So let's wait for the boat to come around and let's get on the boat. Because everyone likes boats. These are like Skies of Arcadia boats. They're flying. Screw th the water boats. Ah, gross. I don't know where that water's been. I don't know why, but I just. just Imagine that these guys are water is just like completely disgusting. So it's like, I don't want to get squirted with that, that's gross. And you got that fun little contraption over there. Which we'll get to in a second. Um, 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 um. First, let's go over there and get that stuff and kill that guy. And come in here to power up that we need three to kill three more enemies to get. Well, there's two of them. And we got another life. That's nice. And so we turn that machine on, and it activates this catapult, which you jump on it, and it launches you onto the boat, which you can then kill these stuff. There's a guy running around here, let's kill him. I'm not sure if we can catch up to him or not. We're gonna see. Come on, Bodhi. Oh, bam. I like charged him when he was behind me, because I'm just that amazing. So let's light the first flame. There's nothing out on that wing. And come over here and light this flame so that the ship can fly up a little bit. Rise up to this level up here with gems and stuff on it. And another bird, what is his name? Thanks for getting our squawk. Ship up, Spyro. Now we can proceed with our counterattack on Zephyr. Please take this talent. Zephyr. Zephyr is the level we're going to be going to in a little bit. Let's see. Let's see where this goes. Three episodes from now I'll be going to Zephyr. I think three left. Three episodes from now, I think. It should be three. Sounds about right. Um, but let's go up here to this power up now. The big bounce. One of three big bounces in the game. Let's not talk to that dude right now because he's just sort of gonna start us in a task. Which we're going to do now. We're going to do the task. How lucky for me that you came along. Fisher. My machinery is oh my god. The gears I need to repair it are scattered Puns all over the track. Are terrible. Did you hop on that trolley up there and get them? I mean, they're not even they're not even trying with puns. It's like what what more is this? Hey, birds have a beak. Let's call him Beaky. Uh, squawk. Collect 50 gears with the trolley difficulty 5. This is a little bit tricky. As in, you gotta know where you're going. So you come here with a trolley, and you gotta shoot stuff sometimes. And jump over stuff. So there we go, we got stuff, and you gotta press right and left to like switch tracks. And if you crash into stuff, you die. And if there's a TNT barrel, you shoot it. And if there's like a little TNT crate, then you jump over it. So let's see here. Shoot the sign so we go the other way. Jump. Bang. Let's come over here. So the TNT crates you jump over them. And let's go through the cave first. Why not? Caves are cool. And we're still set to go that way. That's good. 
Uh, spent so much time on this as a kid. Okay, let's go the other way, actually. Why not? You know, what do we gotta lose? Alright, only six more. Okay, Take that. Come over there. Shoot that. Shoot that. And perfect. Bam. That was great work, Spyro. I know I make that thing look easy, but it's actually not really that easy. So, we got the second of the two orbs. And so now let's come back down here and get these last few gems. And are we good? Not good. How many gems are we missing? Oh shit. What am I missing? Guide me the correct way. Sparks, so hey, look, I see stuff over there. Ah, we have to wait for the next boat. Duh. Okay. So Sparks is saying they're over there. We should get over there. I think we have to come over here. I'm pretty sure we do. Damn, I thought I was gonna get away with finishing this level in like 10 minutes. And that would be cool. Oh god. Okay. Over here. Nope. Oh yeah, from that first thing that I broke. Yeah, I remember. I think I know where I'm going now. And let's dolphin jump out of the water. Perfect. So yeah, there's that way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I know where I'm going. Oh, down here, right? Right? Right. Yep, down there. Perfect. Woohoo! Damn, that was a quick level. I don't remember this being that short. Well, I usually spend a lot more time on the trolley thing, but... So... Get these guys... Eh, they're shooting them. Target practice. Like, no, 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 shoot that guy, shoot that guy, not me. No, not me. Too bad, you. They're, sh they're taking the little small ones in the buckets to shoot the other ones. Clever guys. Make use of their resources. Uh, you know, we have time, I'm gonna do a speedway. Um, I guess Metro Speedway is closer. Metro is the harder of the two, in my opinion. Oh yeah, if you talk to Alora, she'll be like, we want me to take you to a place where you haven't been yet. So if you don't really know which levels you haven't done, then she'll just warp you to the in front of it. So Metro Speedway, I, don't really, I really don't remember my order for this. So let's just do my best. Pigeons. You press the button. When you kill the pigeon, it activates like a switch. And I missed. Pretty much if you miss something in your order, then just, uh, just sort of quit, because if you go back to get it, you're gonna waste any your time that you're gonna, all the time you're gonna need, and chances are you're not gonna have enough time to come back around and get it again, and that pigeon is just annoying. Okay. that pigeon and now let's get that pigeon. On these next pigeons, you come around by where the jumpers are. And multitask on this part, get the jumpers and the pigeons. And let's go over for these ones. Hopefully I'm not making a mistake by coming with this one first. Right, come on, one more. Jumpers are all done. Oh, except all except this one. Okay. So now I come around this way. Did I miss any? Okay, I didn't miss any. I know let's supercharge this part. And now let's stop supercharging. So this guy get the little slow sign guys. They're grumpy sounding. Yeah, so get all these guys before you go for the rest of the arches. But just swoop up back to this top one. Get these ones. Oh wow, I did pretty good on this, I think. Still missing an arch. Where's the last arch? Crap. There it is. Okay. Wow, 15 seconds to spare. That was good. I usually have some sort of trouble with that one. 
But we're gonna go back again for the orb challenge. Who is a little tricky to find. He was behind this waterfall right here. And he's the mayor. He has no face, but he has a giant mustache and nose. He must be a Jewish. Cat burglars <laughs> have been raiding my re-election funds by scaling the walls of the buildings. Would you be willing to help get rid of them? Yeah, sure. Great! The hunter has been able to knock the scoundrels off of the buildings, but we need you to catch the loot before it lands in the canal and is lost. The hunter is waiting for you outside. Good luck! Hey, guess who the hunter is? It's Hunter. Catch the loot before it lands. Difficulty 5. Yeah, this is a little difficult. It helps if you know the order, which I somewhat do. But just follow Hunter. It's a sensible path. Okay, so he's going for that one. There's 12 different loops. So let's come down to this one. Get it. Get this one. Let's get this one. Yeah. Oh, I missed. Crap. It looks like you. It looks like you missed one, but there's always seem to be more burglars trying to rob the blind. Rob us blind. Are you ready to try again? Yes. All right. Take two. Yeah, around that point where there's the turn, it gets a little tricky there. But nothing too dangerous or difficult for me. He has very good accuracy. I mean, you wouldn't take Hunter as the accurate type. But I guess that's why his name is Hunter. Because he's a good at hunting stuff. So... And uh, what happened to his... Now he has a jetpack. He no longer has a set of wings. He has a jetpack. Let's get that one. Yeah, we got some arches. That one's tricky right there, just because you sort of go into it blind. Oh yeah. Bam! Hell yeah. Well done. We got it. You taught those crooks a lesson? 17 minutes. I really want to try and do our icy speedway. Because. Oh no, I don't need to retry. Why am I doing Give up. I don't think I'm going to end up doing this in this episode, though. Because that took me like seven minutes and I did it really quick. So I'm not sure how long icy speedway will take me and I don't want to go for too long because then it just takes like forever to upload. Because with my shit internet it takes forever to upload anyway. But So yeah, we're going to end this episode off here. Next time we're going to do, um, because I promised three episodes till Zephyr. Um, we're not going to go there yet. So we easily could. We're going to go to Skello's Badlands, which is this one right here. And also the one that you see in the... Uh, on the title screen so that's pretty cool so uh if you like what you saw please subscribe to my videos it'd be very much appreciated and this has been consummated burrito cage until next time peace out and have a wonderful day goodbye people